take you on a tour of the brand new 2021 Ranger VX1888 walkthrough windshield boat. How about we hop inside and have a look? With the deck extension in place, the forward casting deck measures 4 feet 4 inches by 6 feet 9 inches. On the port side forward of the console, a hatch covered storage measuring 17 inches by 29 inches and 19 inches deep. For the convenient maintenance, Rangers attached a wiring diagram to the inside of the hatch cover. A fishing bike seat is dead center on the casting deck. Directly forward of the helm station, a hatch opens the aerated 7 gallon bait well. Ahead of the bait well is another locker measuring 13 inches by 16 inches. The height from the top of the casting deck to the top of the cap rail is roughly 20 inches and 10 and a half inches wide cap rail with a rubber non-skid added safety. A fiberglass insert at the bow has a Hummingbird Helix 9 back mounted. It also contains switches for outboard motor trim, bow lights, and accessories, plus two cup holders and tool slots. The Minn Kota Tarova iPilot Link has been upgraded on this boat. Removal navigation lights install in a socket on the front deck next to the Minkota heading sensor. Under gun wall rod holders are all on both sides of the bow. The forward fishing deck is recessed below the cap rail to add safety when fishing and cushion backrests when people are sitting at the bow. We'll move to the in the cockpit now. The boat is equipped at the back with a Mercury 200X Al four stroke and a dual overhead cam design with a tw with 24 valves. An electronic fuel injection is computer controlled with advanced range optimization. The boat is built with Ranger's patented foam flotation system. The boat comes standard with Sea Star hydraulic steering, and the only other connection between the boat and engine is the rigging tube. A screw-in inspection plate provides access to the billage. Four pull-up cleats are on each side of the bow and stern. The stainless steel ladder is on the starboard side of the transom and extends below the hull to facilitate reboarding. The VX1888 WT has a charcoal metallic graphic with a high glossy black paint which is backed on an improved durability. Just forward of the transom on each side are hinged hatches. The line hatch to port reveals open storage with a drain. To starboard, the hatch unveils the crank and batter and the standard Dual Pro 6x3 charger. A ski tow bar screws into place for those two tow, those tow sport days out on the water. The aft in deck compartment to port has open storage and the aluminum hatch which is a smart choice because it's not fle flex when stepped on. The aft fishing deck spans 6 feet 7 inches by 3 feet 5 inches at the deepest pockets on each side. The depth is 24 inches to make room for the motor well. The fiberglass fish stations include tool holders, two drink holders, two rod holders, a forward facing compartment for Plano boxes and a measuring stick. The latch hinge hatch conceals a 20 gallon aerated and timed live well. The 20 gallon live well has an aerator and a timer and a re ranger reinforces the hatch so it won't sag when someone walks on it. Jump seats which are the industry's highest backrest measuring at 22 inches. These are on each side of the fishing station which hold up to added passenger capacity. The bottom cushions lifts up to stow 14 inches by 11 and a half inches by nine inches storage compartments. In the cockpit, the VX1888WT 
deck is covered in marine grade non-skid vinyl that looks good and provides safe footing even when wet. Marine grade carpet lines areas where non-skidding deck isn't needed. All the seats have custom marine upholstery color matched to the boat's graphics. The driver and the companion travel in an air ride seat that also adjusts fore and after. The cockpit seats backs also fold down. With the bucket seats and aft jump seats, there are seating for six behind the windshield. The boat is rated for a maximum of seven people and the total combined capacity for the people outboard and gear is 1,920 pounds. The driver's console is a five foot one inch tall from the console to the bottom of the tempered glass windshield. And the windshield itself is 18 inches tall. The windshield bends at the corners to form a 90 degree angle and there is no distortion from any angle. Engine instruments are installed in a custom fiberglass console on the, comp on the competition steering wheel. The gauge cluster includes a depth finder, a tachometer, a speedometer, and fuel and trim indicators. The Hummingbird Helix 7 sits in a clear view to the right of the wheel. The flush mounted shift throttle control is on the starboard at the comfortable reach from the captain's seat. When the lights are turned on, the gauges are red instead of white to reduce eye strain. Accessory switches, a cell phone tray, and the live well controls are all in down low, which keeps the helm uncluttered. Below the console, there are 12 volt USB ports and live well controls. Accessory switches are labeled with icons and the ignition key and the phone holder are angled up towards the driver. A drink holder is just aft of the panel. Directly ahead of the driver's legs are storage with expandable cargo netting and stereo speaker. In the port console are a locking glove box, grab handle, stereo controls, 12 volt and USB ports, a speaker, and a cell phone holder. Positioning the cell phone tray and charger down low keeps the device protected from water spray. Between the two front seats is a 14 inch by 18 inch deep insulated insole cooler which is a convenient reach and it drains into the village. Down low, ahead of each console, are storage areas with expandable net pockets. Directly in front of the fishing chairs uncovers the recessed Minn Kota trolling motor foot control pedal. The trailer for the VX1888WT comes on a custom built Ranger Trail trailer. It has a tandem axle with 4,700 pound brakes on 15 inch directional painted wheels and tongue jack. It makes it easy to fit into a large garage. The trailer has a swing away tongue with a front entry step. It also comes with a waterproof lights, integrated load guides, and leaf springs. Ranger Boat's road armor protective finish is applied at the factory. The trailer GVWR is a 4,700 pounds. Thank you for watching this video today on the new Ranger 6 Ranger 1888 walkthrough. Anyone interested in this boat or any other boat, please contact us at 780-349-5277 or check us out at www.wpm.ca. Thanks and have a great day.